हेलो गाइस टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट स्पाइनल कॉर्ड लेबल रिलेटिव टू द वर्टिब्रल बॉडीज द स्पाइनल कॉर्ड लेबल डो नॉट करस्पॉन्ड टू द करस्पॉन्डिंग वर्टिब्रल बॉडीज वाई इन आवर बॉडी वी आर हैविंग थर्टी थ्री वर्टिब्रेज फ्रॉम दिस सेवन आर सर्वाइकल ट्वेल्व आर थोरेसिक फाइव आर लंबर फाइव आर सैक्रल फोर आर कॉक्सीजियर वेर एज वी आर हैविंग थर्टी वन पेयर्स ऑफ स्पाइनल नर्व्स in which 8 are cervical 12 are thoracic 5 are lumbar 5 are sacral and one is coccygeal so the number of vertebrae and spinal nerves are different also the spinal cord is going to end at the lower border of l1 in adults whereas the vertebral canal continues downward so spinal cord is shorter in compared to the vertebral canal due to these two reason that is difference in the number of vertebrae and spinal nerves and also spinal cord ending earlier in the vertebral canal the spinal cord label do not correspond to the corresponding vertebrae the spinal cord labels are known as the spinal cord segment here the blocks we are seeing 1 2 3 4 5 these are the spinal segment from which the corresponding spinal nerves arises here we are going to see the relation of these spinal segment with the vertebrae in the lower diagram we are seeing the vertebrae and inside the vertebrae this is the vertebral canal this is the vertebral canal in which we are having the spinal segments the red are the cervical spinal segment the green are the thoracic spinal segment blue are the lumbar spinal segment and yellow one are the sacral spinal segment starting with the cervical cervical segments how we are going to know which cervical spinal segment corresponds to which cervical vertebral bodies here we can see that the upper cervical spinal segment correspond to the same vertebral bodies that is if we take the example of c2 vertebral body then it must lie in the c2 spinal segment as i have shown here this is the c2 um vertebral body which is in the same label as c2 spinal segment which is the second red block if we go to lower cervical spinal segment it is one label higher that is if we take the example of c7 vertebral body then its spi spinal segment should be in c8 like i have shown here uh, the c7 vertebral body is lying at the label of last red block that is the c8 cervical spinal segment from which the c8 cervical spinal nerve arises going towards the thoracic label how we will know which thoracic spinal segment correspond to which thoracic vertebral body here we are seeing that upper thoracic spinal segment correspond to two label higher that is if we take the example of t2 thoracic body then its thoracic spinal segment must be at t4 here we are seeing this is the t2 this is the t2 and the t2 vertebral body has the red block which is the fourth thoracic spinal segment this is the fourth thoracic spinal nerves and it is arising from the fourth thoracic spinal segment and it correspond to the second thoracic vertebral body but the lower thoracic spinal segment is 2 to 3 labels higher it means that if we take the example of t10 vertebral body then the thoracic spinal segment should be at t12 it should correspond to t12 
here we can see this is the T10 vertebral body and here the last green block it correspond to the T12 spinal segment this is the T12 spinal nerve and it arises from the T12 spinal segment and also it is important to know that in some cases we can find three labels higher also that is if we take for example T7 vertebral body then it may lie at the spinal segment corresponding to it may lie at T10 label finally going to quite easier one which is the lumbar and sacral spinal segment hey, first let's talk about lumbar spinal segment all the lumbar spinal segment lies from T10 to T12 vertebral body this 1 2 3 4 5 are the lumbar spinal nerves and this blue are the lumbar spinal segment this lumbar spinal segment are corresponding to here we can see this is the uh, sorry this uh, here we can see this is the T10 vertebral body and it is here T10 to T12 we can see all the lumbar spinal segment are present similarly if we go to the sacral spinal segment they are present from T12 to L1 here we can see this the yellow colored one this is the sp sacral spinal segment and it is present from T12 to L1 vertebral body these are the sacral spinal nerves so guys if you have any doubt related to this please comment below thank you